Now let us see an example for n greater than ampersand one operator. Basically, it will redirect the specified stream to the success stream. So let's see an example for that. So let's go inside a directory that's present. Let's say testing directory. And to get all the child items inside the testing directory, we will take help of get child item commandlet. And we have to mention the path here. And to look for another directory in the same command, use the comma and mention another directory. So let's say, let's give a directory that's not present on the system. Okay. And here we will look for error stream and success stream. And for error stream, let's use two greater than ampersand and one for success stream. And let us show the output inside a file. For that, we will use greater than operator and mention the path. And let's say sigma dot txt and hit enter. So in this case, it will get the child items for the text in directory. That's true. And it will list inside the sigma dot txt file. And it will try to get the child item for this directory, but that's not present. In that case, it will return an error and it will write the error inside the sigma dot txt file. Here it uses true greater than ampersand one to redirect the error stream to the success stream and greater than operator is used to send the success stream to a file called sigma.txt. So let's verify. Come here, look for sigma.txt. And here we can see it has written the child items inside the testing direct and it has also written the error to the file. 